Why do we have to know history? Like, who is gonna remember the Second Great Awakening? Why did I literally do this to myself? We love procrastination. I am free! <laughs> My test is in two days, so I literally have like a little less than or less than 48 hours to study. Wait, what? How long have you been studying? Um, not that long. <laughs> like I've been studying, but I haven't been like studying, you know. But I'm gonna take this is like my second practice test that I've taken. The very first practice test I got like like 75 percent, <laughs> which is passing, but like barely. So. Do you need to get a good grade or do you just need to pass it? We, we, don't, we, we don't even need to pass it. I mean like, we do need to pass it, but like, if we don't pass it, we can like... What's it called like when you like don't... Appeal, you, you can appeal if you don't pass it, but like I want to pass it, so... Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Let's take this practice exam. Okay, I'm on question 17 and okay, this is like one of the things that I'm like, I don't need to know this. Like we don't, <laughs> why do we have to know history? Like who is gonna remember the second great awakening? Do you remember the second great awakening? No. Yeah, I do. No, I we did not. I know he remembers about it. So, <laughs> guys, I don't know. I'm gonna special warning to literally support the comprehension of which areas I'm not the most. Facial awareness. Dang it, I just facial awareness. Guys, I don't know this answer. <laughs> guys, the solar energy is silent. <laughs> Okay, y'all, I just finished taking the practice exam. Let's submit it and see what I get. <laughs> oh, wait. Okay, it's not too bad. 78% is not too bad. I thought I would do worse. 35 correct, 10 incorrect. Hey guys, so it is the next day, literally in less than 24 hours, I'm gonna be taking my exam. I don't know if I'm ready yet. I feel like I'm, I feel like I'm ready, but like, I feel like I should study some more. Still only completed two practice tests, so I need to do some, I need to do some more practice problems and then I'll probably take a third practice test. But my exam is tomorrow, Monday, 8 a.m. in the morning in Seattle, which is like one hour away from where I live. Why did I literally do this to myself? Hey okay guys, so well, let's get to grinding. By the way, it is 9, 10 in the morning. And I'm not gonna be able to study all day today because later my best friend and I were gonna go hang out for the last time before she goes back home to Vietnam. So let's see how much I get done because I know for a fact that after I hang out with her, I'm not gonna want to study anymore. So this is probably gonna be like my last time studying. We love procrastination. Hey guys, so it's currently 3.57. I actually just got out of church, but I'm currently at Panera right now because I have to lock in and I feel like if I'm at home, I'm not gonna be able to lock in. So I'm, I'm gonna continue doing more practice problems, going through for my practice tests, like seeing what questions I got wrong and why. I'm gonna hopefully I don't get copyrighted. But yeah, I don't know how long I'm gonna be here till. Oh yeah, by the way, we're, my friend and I, we're not hanging out anymore because she has to pack, so I'm hanging out with her like later this week, which is probably perfect because I should probably study. <laughs>
could go home right now, but I just want to basically what I did was I took the practice exams and then I wrote down some of the concepts that like I haven't quite gone into my head yet or like the stuff that I got wrong and then I'm just gonna and it came out to be three full pages of notes. So I think I'm just gonna like go through these just like read them and get them into my head so I can remember them. Day. I'm currently in the parking lot of the building that I'm going to be taking the exam in. Guys, I'm, I'm so scared. You know that feeling when you have a pit in your stomach because you're so nervous? That is what I'm feeling right now. But it's currently 7.41 and it says to be there 15 minutes before the exam starts. So I'm probably going to start heading in now. Mm. Wish me luck, guys. The next time you guys will see me in the next clip, I'm gonna be a certified teacher. Well, that's only if I pass the exam. But you'll see me done with the certification exam. I think I'm gonna go, because I see someone going inside the door. Wish me luck, guys. <laughs> guys, this is me after taking the exam. I actually, we actually already got the score back already. Mm, I failed one of my exams. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really- It's- it's fine, it's fine. I literally- oh my god, I was so close to passing though. Like, passing score is 220, I got 205. And then for the first part of the exam was English and Social Studies. That was the part, that was the exam that I failed. Like, why do we even need to know history? Like, I'm just- <sighs> But yeah, the second part of it was Math and Science. And I'm typically- I'm like- Way better in math than English, so I passed that part. But you know what? I'm just gonna appeal. I'm just, I'm just gonna appeal. Okay, but I'm just happy that I'm done with the exam. We're not gonna talk about it and think about it anymore. Hey guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If any of you guys are taking the NES exam, wishing y'all the best of luck. Make sure you study, 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 study. But thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.